page three. God, come to my assistance. Lord, make haste to help me. <clears throat> Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, O God, who is, who was, and who is to come, now and forever. Amen. Alleluia. Conditor al Messi de Rum, et en manus credenciu, Christe Redentor omnium, exaudi preces supplicu, cui con volens in peritu, mortis perire seculu, salvas in mundum languidum, donans reis remediu. Virgin de mundi vesere, uti sponsus de tal amor, egressus honestissima, virginis matris clausula, cuius forti potentiae, genu curvantur omnia, celesti a terrestria, nutu vadentur subdita, te sante fide que sumus en tu regure seculi, conservanos in tempore, ostis a tero perfidi. Si Christe ex pis in me, vadri vadri que gloria, un spiritu paraclito, in sempre eterna secula. If you ask anything in my name, I will do it. Alleluia, praise, O servants of the Lord, praise the name of the Lord. Blessed are they who have been invited to the wedding feast of the Lamb. O blessed are those who fear the Lord and walk in His way. By the labor of your hands you shine. You will be happy across the earth. You will lie like a fruitful vine in the heart of your house. You are to children like the shrews of the earth. Oh. 
Put in your sickle, for the harvest of the earth is fully ripe. They have pressed me hard from my youth, this is Israel's song. They have pressed me hard from my youth, but could never destroy me. They bowed my back like plow and drove me on furrows. But the Lord who is just has destroyed the yoke of the wicked. Let them be shamed and routed, those who hate Zion. Let them be like grass on the roof that withers before it flowers. Without no reaper fills his arms, no biker makes his sheaves. And those passing by will not say, On you the Lord's blessing. We bless you in the name of the Lord. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, to God who is, who was, and who is to come, now and forever. Amen. Put in your sickle, for the harvest of the earth is fully ripe. Blessed are the poor, for theirs is the kingdom of God. Hear this, all you peoples, give heed all who dwell in the world. Men, O Lord, and I, rich and poor alike, my lips will speak words of wisdom, my heart is full of insight. I will turn my mind to a parable. With a heart I will solve my problem. Why should I fear in evil days the malice of the those who surround me? Men who trust in their wealth and boast of the vastness of their riches. For no man can buy his own ransom or pay a price to God for Life. The ransom of his soul is beyond him. He cannot buy life without end, nor avoid coming to the grave. He knows that wise men and fools must both perish and leave their wealth to others. Their graves are their homes forever. Their dwelling place from age to age. Though their names spread wide through the land, in his riches man lacks wisdom. He is like the beasts that are destroyed. <coughs> this is the lot of those who trust in themselves, who have others at their back and call. Like sheep that are driven to the grave, where death shall be their shepherd. And the just shall be called their rulers. With the morning their outward shall vanishes, and the grave becomes their hold. But God will ransom me from death, and take my soul to himself. Then do not fear when a man grows rich, when the glory of his house increases. He takes nothing with him when he dies. His glory does not follow him below. Though he flattered himself while he lived, men will praise me for all my success. Yet he will go to join his fathers, who will never see the light anymore. In his riches man lacks wisdom, he is like the beasts that are destroyed. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, to God who is, who was, and who is to come, now and forever. Amen. Blessed are you, Lord, for your sins are
in the famous catacomb of Callistus. Elsewhere, the heavenly birth of numerous other saints whose names are inscribed in the Book of Life. We fly to the patronage for the Holy Mother of God, despise not our petitions and our necessities, but deliver us always from all dangers, O glorious and blessed Virgin. <coughs> The angel of the Lord declared unto Mary, and she, she conceived by the Holy Spirit. Behold, the handmaid of the Lord. May it be done to thee according to thy word. And the word was made flesh, and dwelt among us. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, my mother of God, pray for us sinners, now at the hour of our death. Pray for us, most holy mother of God, that we may be made worthy of the promises of Christ. Wherefore, that we beseech thee, O Lord, thy grace into our hearts, that we to whom the incarnation of Christ thy Son was made known by the message of an angel, may by his passion and cross be brought to the glory of his resurrection. Through the same Christ our Lord. Amen. 